Hello, wonderful young people. Um, right now, we're going to learn how to use a website called Beepbox. Um, so Beepbox is a website where you can kind of create your own songs and do all sorts of fun stuff um, that you can then export and then use in your Audacity project. So I'm going to go through just, just a few of the settings um, that you can use. Obviously, if you want to dive further into some of the more advanced, advanced settings, you're more than welcome to do that. Uh, we're just kind of going to go through the basics here. All right. So what I'm going to look at first is just this kind of grid, right? So we've got different places where we can click on um, our different rectangles here. And when you click on it, it makes a note. Okay. And you can make those notes longer or you can make them shorter. You can also um, delete notes by just re-clicking on them after you've highlighted them. Okay, so this is a really, really easy way to just kind of experiment with sounds and um, see what stuff can sound uh, like. A um, couple things I'll point out are, uh, the first one is tempo. Okay, so this is the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eighth line down. It has a word that says tempo and then a slider. You're going to want to set, uh, set this to 120, which I just did right there. That's, this is going to match your rhythm track that you have set up on Audacity if you set your rhythm track to 120, which is what I recommend. Okay. Uh, a little bit further down, second from the bottom, is where you can change the instrument. Okay, so you can change it so it sounds like a trumpet or like it sounds like a choir or like it sounds... There's a couple of funny ones. This one says goblins. Um, this one says buzz saw. A uh, bunch. Uh, you can get it to sound like a guitar. You can get it to sound kind of like a violinish sound. Um, let's try a couple. Let's go with a nylon guitar and see what that sounds like. So you can see it was something else because I didn't change it in. Um, this one and then when it got to this one it changed to nylon guitar so that first sound we heard was trumpet and then the second one was guitar so you can kind of hear some of those different sounds all right once you've got this sound in the way you want you can take this from the website and get it onto your computer so the way you're going to do that is go to file kind of towards the top here and down to export song Okay, I'm going to click on export song. You can name the file whatever you like. So I'm going to call it Terrell Music Class Song. All right, you want to make sure um, from this drop down menu you're going to export as an MP3. Wave also works, but I like to work with MP3. So I'm going to go ahead and click on MP3. That's what I recommend. And then click on export. After a second, that will download, and you'll be able to see it downloaded at the bottom of your screen, just like that. And that will go straight to your downloads folder. All right. Thanks, everybody, for watching, and I hope that helps. Okay. Bye, y'all.